I'm Tim O'Day. I'm the owner of O'Day's Barbershop in Reading, Massachusetts. I've been in town 16 years. I literally drove by on my day off and saw the for rent sign in the window. And since I grew up in the area, I thought, what a better place. I just didn't really know what I was gonna do after high school, and I was talking to a couple people, uh, you know, what their plan was after school, and um, a bunch of them said, you know, we're gonna try out barber school, and, and uh, so I gave it a shot, and here I am now. I like to go by names of haircuts rather than, you know, a lot of people go by numbers and stuff, which is fine. They show me pictures now with, you know, the easy access to the phone, which helps a lot. Um, you know, but a lot of people jump right in the chair and say men's regular, flat top, wiffle. So it's, it's for as long as I've been in it, it's, uh, I pretty much know what to do when you get in the chair. A sports uh, uh, decor was always the vision in my head. Have, you know, kids, you know, come in and enjoy their time. Makes them a little easier, especially for kids with like first haircuts and stuff. They feel, you know, easier with all the sports stuff in here. So, you know, I have a, a, a state trooper said, hey, do you mind if I, you know, would you mind hanging a patch up on your mirror? And it started from there. One patch led to all these patches. A lot of customers don't um, mind waiting on uh, certain days where we just do walk-ins, but for the most part, I would say 80% of my customers would rather do appointments. Be able to come in, hang up their jacket, wait for the last customer to be done for a couple minutes and then jump right in the chair instead of waiting, you know, an hour or two you know, for a, you know, 15, 20 minute haircuts. I do all I can to get them back. I would like to have 100% repeat. Unfortunately, you'll never get that. So I do my best I can to um, make them feel comfortable, light jokes, talk about sports, what's going on in the town. And uh, uh, we do get a lot of repeat business, a lot. I had a, I had a lot of help from uh, family and friends opening up my barbershop because I, Grew up in the area, like I said, I was always in Reading as a young kid, hanging out with my cousins, with you know family that were, were all pretty much the same age, and it, it really helped out with my decision cutting hair in Reading. <laughs>